So today we're going to make a spreader plate to help me tailgate gravel when people just want it in the tracks. One thing that's kind of aggravating, people ask for this, you have to throw a block or a 2x6 in the bed. And then it's always a pain getting out. You always have gravel or limestone or whatever you're tailgating you're stuck in the bed and then you got to get up there and mess with it. Uh, so I'm going to take a two inch receiver that I had and so the idea is to make a uh, kind of a triangle shape on top of that so when the stone comes out of the bed off of this plate, it hits that plate and goes to either side and just does the tracks. So what I'm going to do is, I got a little bit of gravel in there left over from the other day. And I'm going to uh, raise the bed and open the tailgate and see where, how far out the gravel's hitting. So that way I'll know where to blow on my plates. See what happens.
All right, so. Whenever. So now you can see. So I'm going down through there tailgating. The gravel is going to come out of that crack. I got my chain set. I'll come right out of there. It's going to hit that plate. And it should divert the stone over into both spots. So I was out here fooling with this thing and I was thinking, you know what? I really need to have this thing with me all the time. So I got to fooling around with it. I took it apart and put it back together. And that thing will sit perfect right down in there. So it's out of the way. Have it with me everywhere I go. But I gotta figure out how to keep it on there without it falling off. So I, th I think I can take one of these pins here, drill a hole here, and put one of those pins in there. I think I'll be good to go. So let's try it out. So I got it mounted on there. I think it'll work pretty good. Got a pin in it down there and a pin in it up there. So I might take a shackle and drill a hole right there and hook a shackle in that in case it does fall off for whatever reason. But I think it'll work pretty good.